Welcome to How to Scream Basic Lesson Number 4. Today we'll be talking about money management and the money system. Previously we talked about weapon damage and it's important to understand which weapons should be prioritized over other weapons. Uh, that builds the rationale of why you should save on certain rounds. Now we'll be talking more about uh, money management and advanced lessons. Today we'll be talking about the money system in Counter-Strike Source. Uh, with regard to our discussion, we'll be talking about the MR15 format. Now in that format, you start off the round with $800 only. Understanding uh, how much money your opponent has will give you uh, insight into what to buy and what to do uh, for your team. For the counter-terrorist, you can win by killing off all the terrorists, defusing the bomb, or by waiting for the timer to count down to zero. For the terrorist, you need to either kill off all the counter-terrorists, or get the bomb planted and have the bomb explode. Now regardless of how you win, you will always get $3,250. The only exception is if you plant the bomb and the bomb explodes, then each player will get $3,500. Now if you lose the round, you will always get $1,400. Um, now for terrorists, if you plant the bomb and the bomb gets defused and because of that you lose, you will get $2,200. For terrorists, if the timer goes down to zero, teammates that have already died on the next round, they would get $1,400. For teammates who are still alive during that timeout, they will get $0 for the next round. For terrorists, if you plant the bomb, every player gets $800 just by the plan that if you lose one round you get $1,400 if you lose the next round again you actually get $1,900 and if you lose the third round again consecutively you get $2,400 for every round you lose consecutively $500 gets stacked up with a maximum stack of $3,400 so if you lose five rounds consecutively on the next round you will get $3,400 if let's say your team is on a losing streak and they are losing three rounds you actually get $2,900 but if you you retry and come back with just $800, you will not get $2,900. Instead, you will just get back $1,400. That comes to the end of this lesson. I hope you find this use useful. We will talk about why you need to save and all that in the advanced lessons later. This will actually build the rationale between why it is wiser to save for two rounds if you lost the first pistol round and what are the implications involved.